This is how to change the battery in your key fob for when you can no longer get into your Cadillac CTS-V or similar vehicle. This is a key fob for a 2013 Cadillac CTS-V Coupe. You'll also see that same fob for, I think Corvettes have the same thing, maybe some other cars. And this is how to change the battery in it when it eventually quits working. The first thing to do is push this piece in and pop out your key, which if you don't know, that goes in the, underneath the trunk, I believe, to get in in case your battery in the car goes dead. Now you've got the actual fob. And as you can see, there's some guts in there. Take a long, thin screwdriver, basically shove it down in there as far as you can, and it'll start splitting the case. Get it as far as you can and just start working it out. And you can kind of pop it by hand eventually. Okay, there's your old battery. You want to get that out. The old one, it's a CR2032, and you see the plus sign is down. So that's what we want to do is put the plus side down. And you see that little silver metal rim, so you're putting it face down. You want to put it up against that rim so it kind of spreads it, puts it in there, so that's all in full contact. Then those, in case it falls apart like mine, that's what contacts the battery. But actually what you want to do is align it in this piece first. So you can kind of see the outline around there. See how that circuit board fits in around the rubber lip. So leave that in there. And then you're going to basically line up that piece to go through the hole. As you can see that piece is shining through and you basically just press it all around and lock it back together. And there it's all complete with your new battery. Put your key back in place. And now with your new battery, good to go. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to learn more about how to enjoy amazing machines like this.